Tom Fowler, CEO of Capstone Information Technologies. This is such a treat. Um, we have Michael Orr here today, and most of you probably know him from Super Bowl championship in football, but you also may know him from his story was um, the inspiration for the movie Blindside with Sandra Bullock. So one of the things I wanted to ask you, obviously you've had um, a very different journey than a lot of us um, have experienced. So coming from the homelessness, um, what are some things, advice would you have for business owners who they're trying different things and it's just not working and they're feeling like a failure, they don't know how to support their family. What, what advice would you have for them? Uh, you know, for me, um, you know, when things start to go wrong, uh, you know, I just look, you know, where I came from. And, you know, it, it was, you know I've been at the lows of lows, I've been at the highs of highs, you know, winning championships and that was that stuff, books and things like that. But, you know, I've, I've taught myself to stay, you know, in between. Uh, you know, and just, you know, not forget where I came from and continue to uh, remember how hard that I worked, to, you know, to get to this point and the grind that it took to, just to stay motivated, you know, no matter what. You know, if you're down, you still got to, you know, work harder than anybody. You know, if you're up, it's, that's when you most definitely have to work with this 10 times hard. So, uh, just staying uh, motivated. Uh, How do you just, stay motivated? What do you do to stay motivated? Uh, stay in the course, uh, stay in the course, and, uh, you know, just, you know, always knowing that, you know, you can always get better in everything you do. Uh, you know, it's, you know, the smartest person in the world thinks he's the smartest person in the world, but it's somebody so you know, just, uh, always, uh, you know, believing in that, and okay. having that and earlier you mentioned that um, a lot of people have always told you all your life that you can't do something. So how, is, is it all inside? Are you just being strong on the inside, knowing you can and you're going to prove them wrong? Uh, you most definitely have to be strong on the inside. Uh, you, know, you have to believe in yourself. Uh, because you know, if you don't believe in yourself, nobody else will. You know, nobody's going to. You know, the thing about it is, I'll, I've always said, nobody's going to feel sorry for you. I never said that. Sorry. You know, nobody's feeling sorry for you, so you gotta get up and you know, do, it, do it yourself. And you know, I, you know, I was in high school. You know, I went to a you know, great you know, academic high school. And then, you know, they, they didn't think I would make it a month. I ended up graduating, you know, passing people up in my class rank and everything. So uh, it just uh, it was wrong. Okay. And one last thing. So, what does it take to be a champion? Uh, you know, perseverance, uh, you know, like I said earlier, preparation, preparing, uh, you know, for anything you do, you have to prepare for it. you got to prepare like a champion, and that's how I work, you know, an entire nation, uh, you know, a world, basically, and, you know, that's basically what it takes to be a champion. So prepare and persevere, so don't be lazy, guys. All right. Thank you so much for listening. If you want to see other videos, go to www.rochesterrockstars.com.